Well, they look just like candy or snacks. You may not even think twice if you saw these for sale, but what's inside these packages isn't food. It's actually marijuana edibles. And Roseville police just busted a big illegal operation at a gas station, several thousand dollars worth of edibles. Megan Woods reports on what parents need to look out for. What would you do if you went to the gas station, bought you a quick snack, you're about to open it, take a big bite, and then you realize it's a marijuana edible? Well, that's what happened to a Roseville family. They ended up going to the mayor, and that's what sparked this investigation. Well, the concern was that they went into the store, and they were able to purchase what they thought were gushers for $12.99, and that was a little outrageous on the price. So they looked at the back of the, the package, and it said, contains THC, keep out of the hands of children. Not only can these packages look like the real thing, detectives also found out they're not hard to get. They basically just walked right into the gas station and asked for the products that were behind the counter and they were sold to them. It's a scary scenario for kids. I mean, I have small children. Uh, one of those looks like one of the uh, treats we used to give our kids all the time. And it's illegal. They shouldn't be selling this stuff. Roseville doesn't even have an ordinance yet to allow the people to sell that stuff. Even if the city did have an ordinance, Chief Monroe says the business would have to be licensed and the edibles would have to be sold at a dispensary, not a gas station. So what does all this mean for parents? Read the label. If you look closely, this bag says medicated chewy cubes. If you look at another bag, there's a small THC label. Police aren't specifying which gas station this happened at, but they did say they confiscated all of those edibles from that gas station. They have made some arrests, but this is still an ongoing investigation. In Roseville, Megan Woods, Local 4. Hey, Megan, and police are asking you to contact them if you've seen other businesses selling these marijuana edibles in Roseville. It's going to be tough for police to stay ahead of. It just looks so like real. the real McCoy. Yeah. <laughs>